Teams are making big changes to try and get a few fans in the stands this year. The Chiefs just announced their attendance limit for the start of the season, and it comes with a big bump in ticket prices. KCTV5's Nathan Vickers asked one longtime season ticket holder if he's willing to pay the price. It's hard to imagine Arrowhead without scores of rowdy fans. Passionate fans, uh, we love our Chiefs. Randy Lynch and his family have been season ticket holders for more than 20 years. I love tailgating and hanging out with family. This year, the Chiefs couldn't allow season tickets because of social distancing measures. Instead, they held seats like Lynch's for next year and gave them first dibs on buying single game passes. For his seats, they're around five times the price, nearly $300. It's a lot for a regular season game. That's for sure. A price not everyone in the tailgate group can afford. We just decided not to do it this year because um, we like our group of people, so we're just going to tailgate at home. The Chiefs are limiting capacity to 22%, which means only about 16,000 fans will be coming through these gates every week. They're also still planning what parking, tailgating, and concessions might look like in 2020. We completely understand and expected the response because it is a significant jump. Chiefs President Mark Donovan explained today that this season's prices are based on an algorithm and were set even before the team announced a reduced capacity. Even with the jump in price, he believes the tickets will only go up on the resale market. What we're trying to do is be fair, but represent the market. The season's not a total loss for Lynch. Decided to get one ticket just so I can be at one game. After all, he's friends with some Raiders fans whose team won't be hosting any crowds this year. He called me up and said, can you get tickets, please, please, please? And I said, I'll see what I can do. For him, the only thing more important than bragging rights... They will lose, but they'll enjoy themselves at, <laughs> before the game. ...is optimism, especially with this team. In Kansas City, Nathan Vickers, KCTV 5 News. And if you can't make it out to Arrowhead Stadium this year, don't worry. The Chiefs play here. Nine games can be seen right here on KCTV5. The first one is against the L.A. Chargers on September 20th.